I want to find out what they do in the room because it's a no smoking building. Mm -hmm. So it's against state law. So I don't want to get us in trouble because we're allowing someone to break the laws. So I'm going to go up there and take a look and see if they were smoking in that room. My name is Craig Carlos Valentino. I am now almost 60 years old and I've lived in the San Francisco Bay Area my entire life. The last um, eight years, I have been exclusively here on 6th Street running this building. Well, they've been smoking in here. Yeah, they definitely, definitely have been smoking in here. I get up, open the window uh, 8 o'clock, start taking care of all the guests that are checking out. The list for the maids, uh, make card keys for the guests that are going to be coming in, and then handle any new bookings that are coming in or help anybody that's, you know, need help finding things. And I open the front desk at 8 in the morning. I close it at 12 at night. So do the math. It is illegal to smoke in a room. You guys don't come from here, so you're like, oh, okay, it's no big deal. Yeah, it is. They can charge your credit card $250. You know, it's one of those, if I had walked by last night and smelled it, you guys would have been put out last night in the rain. You get the knuckleheads that just want to act up for whatever reason, drugs, alcohol, mental, you know, it kind of makes it hard. We had one guy who, I don't know what he was on, but he was running up down the hallway naked. It gets hard when... You walk down the street and there's drug needles all over the street. I've got guests that have canceled because they did not like walking down 6th Street. I've had guests that canceled because when they drove by, they were like, no. We were talking earlier about the parking that, I got guests that can't even park in front of a load without fear of being towed. Um, there's no parking anywhere for the guests. So at the most busiest time, my guests have to park across the street if there's a place across the street or they gotta park one or two blocks down to take their luggage. So it's like, we're being that much more of an inconvenience to our guests. And eventually, the guests will stop coming 